Also, you know, Sister Karen and Self Help Graphics was a crown jewel in their achievement. So it was important to them that we maintained a successful profile. All the success, all the missionary work we were doing with Chicken Art and Culture is basically a message to the world, which is we are not here to eat your young. We're just like you. You know, we're more alike than we are different. You know, I used to have to, I used to joke with other places. If, you know, I'd go to, and they, that, you know, I'd go to audiences where they, you know, they, you know, what's Chicano? You know, and, and and I'd sit there and I'd say, you know, I'm here to tell you that I'm, we are not here to eat your young. And, go, oh, and you know, break the ice, you know, because once you do that, you know, it's the people either going to dump up and leave, or they're going to laugh, and you go, this dude's cool. <laughs> And, and um, oh, I remember one time, and I, I had just done a spiel, we had done a collaboration with the Autry Museum. And same thing, everybody was like, why are you doing that? They gave my curator, who was just a secretary for a local gallery, and then was really just a volunteer for Kaiser, and eventually started curating over at Self Help. They gave her the opportunity to co-curate a major exhibition. They hired her two sons. They had us writing, they had us doing, and then I get to do the spiel for the collaboration. So they were really genuine about collaborating. And I do my spiel, and you know, Chicanos are both cowboys and Indians, and blah, 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 get da, 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 da. Oh, okay, great, he's a great guy. And I'm sitting down with this lady, and she's one of these culture coaches, man. She's got like turquoise up and down the arms. The girls are out, she's got the bracelets, or the, the necklace sitting on top. And you know, she's all with the big hair. She goes, well, honey, I want you to tell me something. Now, if I go down there to this, self-help graphics Chicano place, am I going to be robbed? And I looked at her and I said, honey, if you come down here with all that stuff that you wear tonight, I'll mug you myself. And she actually became a friend of ours and came and would drop a load of money in our little store. But it was like that, you know, it was always that kind of thing that was going on in terms of some of the things we were doing. Uh, I guess I lost my place. I just, you know, I was really happy that we were able to say, you know, this is this is part of American culture. This is part of the fabric. And it's unique and it's identifiable and it's important and significant and it's separate, but it's also part of the overall fabric. That to me was important. And I'm, I'm proud of that we did.